And welcome back to the long run. We're playing this game, Crosscode. We're after Maroon Valley. Unfortunately, Emily is off is offline right now, and our new guildmate, uh, Citron, is a little busy. So we're gonna be looking around by ourselves for a little bit. Also, I tell you who plays video games, your brother. Um, did he take MLK off or something? I feel like a lot of people took MLK off from streaming, which... Why? Was there a thing that I didn't know about? You know, you the puzzle. You entered Maroon Valley, hot sandy desert, and home of a shod. All units welcome. You should visit Baki Kun. Bustling town of Shad. Has big bazaar with great offers. Ooh. You may want to know more? Talk to me. Oh. Is that Emily? It is. Orulia. Hi. Say, are you currently free? I'd really like to join your party right now, if you're okay with that. Ça bien? Did you just enter Maroon Valley by any chance? Okay, I'll be there in a second. Thanks for waiting. Did that birdman over there talk to you as well? He does that with any new player who stands around for too long. Huh? I was surprised to see a non-human race after all. Anyway, we should head to Baki Kum, right? Sounds like the next big town. Well then, off we go. Well, let's get all of these traders documented. Over here. I think that's everyone. Uh, no, these are bird people. They are, they are super warbs. All right, let's see what we're dealing with in this area. Okay, not too bad. Man, we played so long yesterday now. I barely got any sleep last night. Or rather, today. Okay, we, we got all of that conversation. Oh hey, it's Henry again. We just finished your last quest. What you got for us this time? What heat? I guess I need help yet again. Leah! Hello! Hi! Another fateful meeting. I just left another player with the task to place the probe. It was easier than I expected. Oh wait, somehow I got carried away. Anyway, would you like to help again? Let's see... Someone just can't ask, funny looking guy. I don't care as long as the job gets done since I need the data. Interesting. Yeah, we're not going to be using fire very much. Are you sure? That's amazing! Thank you so much! The tasks are the same as last time. I want to gather some data for Maroon Valley this time. It's a rural area, but I need the survey data. Here's another compiled list for you. There's some cave here in the valley. Sorry, I'm awfully agitated today. There's an enemy literally named Tim. Thanks, please come back once you're done. 
And in case you forgot what the probe looks like, it looks the same as the one next to me. Yeah, yes, yes. Alright, so... Arid Lumber, I think that's something that we were supposed to get in uh, Bourbon Trail. Which, oh well, I guess. Also, we, I, I never went back and cleared these. I'll, I might eventually go back and just clear them off screen. It's nothing particularly uh, interesting that happens when you do so. Hit now. By the way, I'm currently studying. Didn't tell you before, no? So I'm in this course that gives out Kima Sans, yeah? We and today I had a bit a bit of trouble with all of that. Why? Uh, it's a bit complicated. There's something there. Huh. When I pushed up against this, it actually toggled the uh, the ninja costume on and off repeatedly. Which is what was causing that uh, milk effect. Dang it. I think there is one enemy here where fire will be useful. shards here. So you see, we have this meeting today. Never once was supposed to do that work before then. The thing is, I didn't know about it. Oh, that took us right to rank B. Ah, uh, just managed to frickin... Run out the timer. So to break these guys, you just gotta hit them with a fully charged VRP while they're out of the, while they're out of the uh, sand. Bit heckin' windy. Yep, 
Yeah, so these guys you actually do want to uh, hit with fire until they break, and then you can hit them with anything. I think these like the worm volcano thing are the ones that are called him. And so we got the three tins. So we just need some more of the birds actually, and that's uh that'll be a delight quest. This way, I guess. So we came here for nothing, and how do we get back? Oh no, what if we don't? What if we're just stuck here for the rest of. Oh, there we go. Too early. we can do this. I'm just gonna bounce too many times and not get to the end. Ah! Can do it from a different angle though. And we also have the lock for here. Actually walk through here? Yes. So apparently you can't walk back through here. So we're just stuck here for our pool. Oh, there we go. There are definitely a few things in this game that I wonder if I'm doing it the intended way or not. They did send me a message about the meeting, you see. So I guess what happened? It ended up at spam. Also, I wouldn't, I wouldn't see it. Who checks their spam, their spam on a regular basis, no? It really defeats the purpose. I personally never had that happen, but... Uh, I guess if your spam filter is too strong, it is a thing that can happen.
Got him. Good job, Emily. We're almost to our next level. Interesting buttons to press up there. More sand sharks. I guess they're called sharksters. Story short, I missed the meeting today. I slept in, arrived too late, the meeting was already over. One of my team members saw me and asked me where I'd been, but I just told her I played Crossworld. She got so angry, I tell you, lecturing me about how life is not all fun and games. Seriously, had I known about that stupid meeting, I would have showed up. But no, I play games, so I must be a child and irresponsible. And I was so pissed. Oh well, let's go on. The triple party? The three person party, you mean? Uh, Citron is not available right now, so. Uh, he is not able to join us. We finally got birds and crossbows, but yeah, other than the space birds that is. That's up a level. Well, that was wrong. Get anywhere from there. Uh, of course, I promised I'd do my part as soon as possible. I was so mad, no way I could concentrate on work. Yeah, I I definitely feel that. It is that that's probably like what what's up right now, so she's supposed to be working on the thing. But instead she's playing crossword. And I can I can definitely um empathize with the whole concept of needing to get things done and just being frustrated and using video games as a coping mechanism. Don't break the, ca the cactus juice. But playing games can be a productive thing. I will- I am definitely going to need to play a fair amount of Meredith coming up when I start working on the uh, Meredith Archipelago project, which I definitely am going to start working on tomorrow. 
I did have some issues that prevented me from actually doing any work last week. And there might be some issues that will make it a little bit tricky for me to do this week. But at least I got a build environment. I was able to actually build Meredith from source. And uh, I'm gonna start thinking about implementing Archipelago. Also, we're back at the start, I just realized. Okay, so we do have arid lumber in Maroon Valley. Definitely can't go down there, unfortunately. Awkwards. Get low on health. I think I want to disengage from battle after this one. Got the health regen. I thought I got to play some crossroads. I have some. Whoa, look at this! Be Faiho Temple, no? Well, to be honest, I may have overdone it yesterday. But it was so much fun, no? Sometimes make you wish you could just stay in the world. No, dangerous thinking. But yeah, let's not neglect real life like this, Takao. I'm sure it won't end well. Yeah, there's something the matter. I know, I tend to talk too much, but you know. If something is bothering you, you can just tell me about it. Just like I did, you see? Yes, I feel much better already just by speaking with you. Uh, I, won't, I won't pressure you, but you know I'm here to listen, okay? That's what friends are for, right? Ah! Okay, I got my feel of this view. Let's go on. We have made a friend. We have made a friend. Looks like we're almost there.
Alright, so we got the enemy quest down. Still need to find all the of the landmarks and the probe. And also the items. Which there are two items that we haven't even found one of yet. Here we are. That should be the village. So how about we go and visit the major building now? You know to continue the plot and all. So yes, we we have a village full of bird men and women. And maybe other people? I don't know. I don't think Harvey Birdman is here. The bird guy wasn't lying, no? That's one big bazaar. Hi! Ah, uh, Seeker, you are greeted. Much pleasing as well from heroic presence. Much useful wisdom could be learned from communication. I dare proclaim with great with greatest certainty. But, as humans like saying, time is of the essential ingredient for early bird. Uh, not quite, but okay. To honor clever statement, let us swi swiftly slice core problem at our hand. I mean, kind of, Joel. Transport with important content and long expected to arrive from Bergen Village. It has not. Content very precious and important. Desert Dangerous. Human following? Excellent. Including you, Strong Seeker. Find help, uh, find transport and help it reach us. Then get reward, yes? Please. Sure. That good decision, smart human. Wealth awaits the both of us. There's transport along main route from Bergen Village to Baki Kum. Should be guarded by two employees of generous Baki Bazaar, unless eaten by hungry desert life. If still alive, complain about the way, then help deliver to continue. If eaten, shame, but business must go on. Return for less convenient plan B. Bye. A little bit of uh, parkour that we can do around here, though. Hi! I greet you, Seeker. The proud explorers of the Arid Breeze are honored by your visit. My name is Jonathan Lorenzo Mahir El Valente Al Nassar, the leader of our company of Braves. Leah? Don't worry, to my friends, I am just Joel Mahir. And everyone is a friend to me, especially a pretty seeker like yourself. Hi. It would please me to listen to the story of your exploit seeker, but first we must water our accomplishments. Mighty beard guy, yeah. The a great place of importance in ancient society is almost in our reach after all these years of searching. And we know of the final puzzle that would complete this and we know of the final piece that would complete this puzzle. It must only be collected now. So young seeker, do you want to claim that honor? Sure. Blended. With a seeker like you by our side, I can almost taste the juices of success. Mm. Interesting timing for that smug look there. The object we need is a stone tablet with ancient inscriptions on the map of the area in the old times. However, it has been claimed by a pack of dastardly driller toys. Of course, they are of the stubborn and cowardly kind. 
They'll just hide among the uh, hide under the rocks and never move. But fret not, for we have requested a mobile explosion dispenser for our friends in Vermin. With that apparatus, you'll be able to clear out the cave and clean the tablets. We will prepare some of our best tea for your return. Hi! I'm trying to remember what the climbing points are around here. Ah, I think this is one of them. Yeah, now we're on the roof. Now we're no longer on the roof. <laughs> Try that again. Oh, there's a shiny over here. Log, log entry number one. Tomorrow's the day. The ACF sends us out for another big expedition to one of the SOS sectors. Apparently it's old war territory. I don't know what they want us to find there but scrap metal and great stones, but whatever pays the bill, right? The official task is to chart the sector and scan planets when possible. Standard ATF exploration. <laughs> Alright. Be careful now. jumping puzzles. Okay, can't can't get up on that pillar, apparently. Maybe from here? Ah, there we go. Okay, so now we're up here. Give us the sprout of space. Okay, can't get back up on there, so. Now I can just get you over here. A tattered satchel. Level 28. And that boosts our appetite by 100%, which I believe increases numbers of available buff slots. So now we can have two buffs at once. Not that we've really been using buffs, but it's something that we can do.
I don't think we can jump on this, uh, on this one here. I want to get back there. So what's back there? in town instantly stomp on age-old architecture. Well, I mean, these blocks here are not age-old. For sure. They're just instant matter barriers. the chance to gear up a little bit. I'm gonna hold off. There's a bridge! Finally! Wasn't a single one in the desert. Mistakes, just happy to laugh at them. So true. Bob Ross, ladies and gentlemen. Dear humans, I'm Aldris of Bakiku. You have my thanks for visiting our small, humble town of Sha. For many years, humans and Sha have worked together. We traded, we shared, we fought together. So today, Akiku and his town are both Shad and human. We know that humans want to learn about ancient. Ancients are ancestors of a Shad, yet we know we still know little. Therefore, we want to help humans. Akiku is home of mystic statue. Statue holds key to Firewood Temple. Important place for seeker human. However, statue only reacts if human holds shiny ore. We have shiny ore that we'll give to human. We have one request. In east part of Maroon Valley, you find the thick Maroon Tree. Maroon Tree, very important to Shad, attacked by sandworms of track. We ask human to defeat the pesky sandworms in cave below Maroon Tree. We will give Shiny Orb for defeating Sandworms. Human help Shad, and Shad will help Human. Is a trade. Please talk to me to accept tasks. In the name of all Shad, thank you for this. So we got to save the, tr the tree, Bakar. Sounds like a mandatory request. Let's accept it. Human, are you willing to help us in exchange for Shiny Orb? Not like we have a choice. You have our deepest thanks. Please take this path. We need it to enter cave below the road tree. Good luck. Lydia, I want to check out the balcony. We I like this place. Everything is so bright and colorful. Hmm. Yeah. I'm not getting on your nerves, right? You know, I'm aware that I talk a lot. And you're very quiet most of the time, just listening. I just hope I'm not bothering you in, in, in that way. You sure? It's okay? Okay, that's good to know. 
Oh, and I'm very much fine with you being so quiet. You actually remind me of an old friend of mine. Still, I'd really like to know more about you. So, maybe someday if you feel like it, please tell me more about you. Well then, I suppose I better log off now. Well, you see, I've still got to do my part of the, of the assignment. So, no all-nighter tonight. Sorry. And again, merci for playing with me and listening to my rambling. That really helped me a lot. Don't worry, I'll hurry up with my work. I'll be back soon enough. And don't forget our, our race at the Fighter Temple. Au revoir. Bye. He talks like the Skyrim cat people. But yeah, um, something to note. I don't think Emily knows that we have a speech module malfunction. Why? How? How? Why? Yeah? Is everything okay? Why? I don't understand. Ow. Yeah, I am sorry. I get- WHY?! Okay. Back. Wondering about your real life, correct? I was afraid you would ask sooner or later. I'm not sure if this is the right time. Why? Leave me no choice. Okay, Leah. Please promise me to stay calm. Leah, you, your real self, currently in a coma. You have been suffering from head trauma for several months now. For some strange reason, it seems that you have regained your consciousness within Crossworld. That is why we play the game, Leah. By recovering your memory in the, in the game, we hope to. We hope you will be able to wake up and realize. Leah, please calm down. We still have everything under control, okay? The situation is serious, but this is no race against time. We just have to try out everything and hope for the best, okay? I'm sorry that I, that I could not bring myself to tell you this earlier. I just... I knew it would be difficult. Look, Leah. I really cannot imagine how you must feel right now. All I can tell you is that there is hope. If we continue playing Pokemon. Well. So, let us not give up, okay? It is probably better to give you more time to build up this. Shall we call it a day? Okay, Leah. See you tomorrow. Oh snap! Things are happening. Also, things are happening in our dreams. Maybe I overdid it. Makes you wish you could just stay in this world. This world. Gave it to me to design as I please. This is what I always dreamed about. So why would you harbor all these doubts? Things are just fine so far, no? Please stay calm. This is no race against time. Look, Leah. I really cannot imagine how you must feel right now. So we finally meet. It must feel really strange, hmm? Seeing me like this. That's why they told me to stay away from you. 
but I don't care anymore. Because I want you to feel it as well. This hell we're going through. Just because of you. Good morning, Leah. Are you okay? You look scared. Did you have a bad dream? That is unfortunate. I mean, it is a good thing to ha that you have those dreams. They're all, they are the gateway to your lost memory. But of course, they will also include the things that you would rather not remember. I assume you do not precisely remember any people or places yet, do you? Okay, we just have to give it enough time. Anyway, I thought it would be better for you to have some company today. After all the things I told you yesterday. So I planned to wait until Emily was online, but it seems she's rather busy at the moment. But then I noticed that this Hexacast person was online. The one that contacted you yesterday, remember? Why not give him a call? Hi! Oh, good morning, Leah. How are you doing? I tried, I forgot. Um, I hope you're doing fine. So, should we start a party today? Okie dokie. How about we meet at the West Entrance Landmark, the one uh, right to the north of Baki Kun? All right, I'll be right there. Bye. There's still a couple of things I want to do in town, but let's go pick up our party member first. I think this is the right way anyway. Yeah, there he is. There we are, hello. Hi! So finally we meet. I already introduced myself before, right? Well, I know Citron is a bit strange. You can also call me Toby if you like. Or Troni, that's what all the guild members call me. Ow! Huh? Drat, you can't speak! I forgot again. I'm so sorry, I tend to be a bit of an airhead sometimes. Emily isn't around. She is probably busy with her uh, her class work, honestly. Oh, too bad. I didn't get the chance to meet her yet. So, since we're both here, did you already finish in that Maroon 3 quest? Neither have I. So, how about we do that quest together? Sound good? Okie dokie. Let's go then. I mean, of course there is no reason to rush. We can do a couple of, of uh, other quests first, or just a floor, whatever you prefer. Oops. Interesting that it lets us walk around here. There doesn't seem to be a purpose for it, though. I prefer swimming! Unfortunately, instant matter disintegrates instantly uh, with water. So. Oh, what's over here? Treasure. Ancient Earth. Explorer waiting over here. Oh, there's a treasure box down there. 
couple of Phoenix feathers. I think this is the area in the back that uh, I was trying to get to as well. Yeah, there we go. We've opened this up. Giga Spiral Drill. Hmm. I wonder if this is some sort of reference. Hope you misheard what, Jewel. Brett has strong will for his deal. Excuse me, what? He is flower. Uh, I didn't say that until I just said it now. I don't think I can jump from there to there. Aside from the fact that it might not even be on the same level, that's too far of a jump. Jump harder. I would think that I would should that I should be able to climb up there. Put some Nikes on, pump them up. Oh, we might actually. Uh, Toby gave me an idea. There we go. And now what? Because we can't get over there. inside a building? Really? I see. So just pushing this uh, this thing of water against this fire is gonna do nothing. Well, I guess you're dead. Nice damage, indeed. So I think that's about all of the exploration for this area. That's what I wanted to do anyway. I think there's still a couple of quests that we can pick up though. Oh dear. Sure, what happened to your face? Hi! Hi, Seeker! Always nice to see fresh faces in this dusty old town. Come, join this old man and his array of local blabbermouths. The Seeker, hooray! Hey, Seeker, welcome! Greetings. Hi, hi, hi! Baki Kun might be small, but it is a good place. Full of harmony and peaceful coexistence. Old human forgetting much theft happens of our, uh old human ha forgetting much theft happens on our markets. Very disrespect. Yes, yes, such mean. Yeah, of 
course, some silly hotheads seem, can, still can't seem to appreciate the merits of our cooperation. In my guards, they always see nothing. It hurts to think, but to think of them as unreliable when they should inspire trust. But Grey Human, you're a seeker to deliver great justice. She could help. Hmm, indeed, she could. But remember, they're very busy folk. So, Seeker, could you spare some time in, on helping our shy friends? I think so. Hooray! Yay! Thanks. Ah, young folks being so helpful. It warms the soul heart. The crimes against shy kind usually happen at the bazaar in the town center. You should talk to some of the residents and guards. They might be able to tell you in detail what happened recently. Best start with Bilson, the chief guard at the on the current shift. He should be at the center of the bazaar. Bye. Human Preservation Department. And also the Maroon Baki Guard. Um... Is there any other quest? There's a solar farm here. I read about this. Built by the humans to help the Shad. If there's a way to climb up there. But I can't. I definitely can't jump over there. Seems that we have to come in from here. Wait, these ones. Good thing we're instant matter, otherwise we'd probably crack these panels, and also they're probably very hot. I got three ancient earth. all the quests that we have right now? There might be some others, I'm not really sure. What is this, Baker? Can't you see that I'm busy keeping order in this unruly place? I... Shy Birch is being robbed. Is that the story of the day again? That's completely impossible. Not on my watch, anyway. And it's always my watch during business hours. Listen, Seeker, I know your kind always searches for grand adventures and villains to slay, but this is just some village ploy by them shady scale skins to cash in on compensation. Anyway, there is watch to keep. Don't waste my time unless you can present some solid proof. I... Now we need to meet... Seeker, can I help you with anything? Leah. Ah, you're here because of those criminal activities here on the market. I see, so the sergeant's finally losing his patience. I can't blame him. 
Listen, I want this to be solved as much as he does. The Shadow are honest and trusting folk, they don't deserve this. Just, it always happens without without any of our, without any one of us or the traitors noticing. We're completely at a loss. Honestly, one would think that at least Bilston would know something, that crazy workaholic. But no, that stuff just seems to vanish without any trace. Believable. Now we have to meet with two Shad. Let's try and figure out where they are. Ah, there's one. Hi! You mean asking about crime on market? It'd be a problem. Good and money, uh, goods and money vanishing from market stand. We shut bu busy selling quality crafts for fair price to happy customers, so no notice. The bearded guard, he cared very much, very much. All his visiting, asking about money, blue breaks, and giving hints for safety. Still, things get stolen. Be very disappointed and sad, I fear. One more shot. There we go. Hi. You can seek or do search for a coat maker on market? Hooray! Trade was hard times with, uh, with money and goods being stolen. Most worried guards lose interest in case. Mustache guard very watchful, but he also speak much to rectangle. Yes, yes, weird small rectangle he sometimes talk to. Seem much much importance to him. Rectangle, huh? Search the market with your analysis to find more specific clues. Do do. <laughs> yes, hello, Amir. Is that you, boss? Hi. You sound weird today, boss. Please don't get angry again. I'm still laying low at the solar farm, just as you said. Everything's alright, yes. Mm. Hello? Boss? Did anything go wrong? Hi. I'm just sitting here. Hi. Rhymes in the bazaar? What are you talking about? I don't know anything. Interesting that you would jump to that conclusion, but again, you are an NPC and are just responding to me saying literally anything. So it was you and the communicator. Damn that Dustin. I thought someone as ruthless as him would at least be more careful. You broke me into this, I swear. Told me all about the money, threatened me if I refused, all that. No one will care about it, he said. Those scaly idiots don't know how to handle the money anyway. Much for that. Well, time to come clean, I suppose. At least I can bring down that jerk with me. Speaking of that jerk. Well, well, well. Where might you lot be going? Hi. I knew something was wrong unless I noticed my communicator missing. You sneakers are in sneaky lot, hmm. Forget it, man. You you messed up. This is over. It is, right? Oh, for you it is. Me though, I prepare something special for just for moments like this. Oh dear. This will be the end of you, and no one will ever know the truth. Dude, look where we are! This is madness! Silence! Those expensive preparations won't go to waste. And I'm out of here. I... Well, you know how to handle this, right? Good, so I'll just be hiding around that corner. Good luck. So the idea is, we gotta break this guy, 
which breaks all of the shields so that we can actually destroy the cannons, which is our actual target. Oh, jeez. You can also break the shields uh, individually by breaking the uh, the cannons before they pull off one of their big shots. And now that all the cannons are done, now we can take out the uh, shield emitter. Certainly something, but leave it to Seekers, save the day, huh? <laughs> anyway, time to go on our ways, right? Bye. The, uh... What? After all we've been through? I was a victim as much as anyone else here. Alright, alright. I'll turn myself in. This is just across the street. see myself inside, so bye, Sneaker. Sorry for the trouble, and thanks for not letting me die, I guess. Bye. Hi. Seeker, welcome back. He just had a troubled young man confess his crime. He certainly did bad things, but he came clean, so I don't think we need to punish him too much. The other things he said, though, it makes me sad that a bad egg like Bilson was just among us. Yeah. I should have been more vigilant. Maybe this old man has become too soft with age. Oh no! Oh, human is best as a protector. Yes, preser uh, preserving great peace for shattered humans. True, mistake happened. That life. Shucks, you're too kind with this rusty soldier, and it is true, we should just look forward. Thank you for the help, Seeker. Bilston is still at large, but his crime should stop for now. I hope we can count on your help again, in case more trouble arises. Goodbye. Goodbye, Hero Seeker. Protect more justice. Bye. Bye. And we get a level up for our troubles. Makes sense now that our talking thing doesn't work. Okay, so what do we got here? We gotta do the maroon tree, poise cave on vivid path, shot transport on the main route from Maroon Valley, and then also the quests for uh, Henry. So where is Vivid Path? That's over here. Guy has to rewrite thousands of volumes of code for her to be able to say ah. Shark skeletons? That's funny. Sharks don't even have proper bones, it's all cartilage. Hi. Ah, please, no eat skilly shad. Oh, dummy. Open eyes, it's not a monster, it's human. Oh, yes, that's true. Such danger here, not good for shad nerves. Your big baby. It's human here to help. Us could need help with great problem. 
sent by the bizarre boss itself? Such kindness, he thinking of rockers. You more think of precious cargo, me think. No matter, help is help. Seeker, look at transportation platform behind us. It's hot, it's fine human technology. Help us move much crates, but now it's broke. Yeah, shield still works, so monsters eat precious so no monsters eat precious cargo, but floating device not work anymore. Meaning we suck like rock, and we need materials for repair, like refined metal from city. Also arid lumber and vivid water. Both found in desert. It pit it pit plant. Yes, but different plants not forget. Isn't that it? Human understand and bring materials? Good news. Please help please hurry and help us move again. Yes, we wait and guard crate and try not to be eaten. Bye. And I think we already have the materials. Hi. You got needed materials? It's splendid. Yes, it's splendid. Now we can do repairs and leave Sandy Shark Place. Yes, but one problem. The repair engine platform needs restart, including shield. Oh no. Then monsters can attack precious cargo. Seeker, we need more help. Please also protect tr uh, transport for time needed to restart. Yes, yes. Please help. It only around two minutes. Good, good. Please prepare for protection and talk again when ready. Are we ready? I think so. We've been doing pretty well in battles in general so far. Getting a little low on health, but um, we can at least give it a try. And if we fail, it's not a big deal. We'll just we can just repeat the quest as many times as we need to. Hi. Human ready to defend great? Hooray! Good, we start are we starting repairs then. Please protect crate till shield is back. Oh no, bad feeling. Seeker be ready. Angry bone creatures come near. If you see one of them doing like hateful bone noises or anything like that, that means they're about to attack the crate. Spawned. And I'm dead. Fortunately, it puts us just right back here. Um, okay, double triangle to skip. Or double, uh, double X, I guess. Oh, come on! Just immediately flank me.
Okay. Much more under control this time. And Leah never woke up from her coma again. Yet. <laughs> Yeah, that's two hits. And we are clear. Human did good job. Yes, cargo saved, chat saved, day saved. Hmm. Now travel continue, hopefully uneventful. Boss is boss already angry as is, I wager. We hurry then. Boss very scary. Thank you and goodbye, seeker. Talk to boss in time for reward. Bye. GG. Alright, so back on to wrong button. Uh, this is the long piece. Okay, vivid path is to the north, then to the east. That's the white sandwich crumbs off her face. This must be the cave. The cat four pool seven. Thank you for deciding to use the cat four pew seventeen, the ideal choice for mining, demolition, pest control, and passionate festivities. I'm sorry, what? This highly advanced machine is programmed to follow its user after after activation and Dispenses explosive devices, also known as bombs, after being charged after being hit with a charged ranged attack. When reloading and generally dis, uh, generally not dispensing bombs, it will try to evade the movements of its user with highly refined movement algorithms. It can also be manually deactivated again at this console, or it will automatically return to the idle state when the user leaves the space of operation, for example, a cave. Warning, keep stored in dry and cool locations, should only be used by trained personnel, keep far away from children and dogs. I do find it interesting that they they went with sandwiches as the um, the healing item in this game. Which is our very cost effective. Move the boulders and pick up the chest. Uh, 
Oh no. More of them. Oh jeez. Oh come on. Oh my goodness, another four of them? Thank you, Toby. Oh, five more of them. Oh, good. I'm enjoying this battle. Especially the parts where I completely win. charge here. Not really sure why you released the bomb? Pick up the chest. Age travel guide. Turn to station. Next thing we gotta do, I think we gotta go around here so we can get onto this screen, which is where the maroon tree is. Right. 
can't actually go here. All right, Jewel, uh, we're almost done for today anyway, so thanks for sticking around for the majority of the stream. I appreciate you being here. Have a good night. I'm just trying to remember how you get to there. this here, but it's not active. Okay, maybe we need to deal with these friggin' sand sharks. seeing that target over there. I think I can hit that. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, that turned that on. Okay. Here, what does that signify? I can press this button. Hit that switch. And do a couple of things there. Scream. Hmm. How do I get over there? So this is on. So if I get up there, down to here. No, that's that's a destination. Fortunately, they made this game so that uh, your party members cannot aggro uh, other enemies. These sharks are going to be tricky to hit. Good thing I have homing BRP is. This, this guy with easy mode BRP is. Oh man. So I don't think we're going to be able to get to the maroon tree. <laughs> Simply because I don't remember how to get there. And it's apparently not obvious. 
There's a lot of weird platforming in just in this game in general. It's pretty satisfying when you figure out something though. If I do this, maybe. to get this. There we go. We get chilla dogs. Hmm. I don't think we can get over there. Not from here anyway. Okay, so we're here. That lets us go over to here. Which I think at the end of this path was just a locked chest anyway. Oh, it's bronze locked. Beef span. Just wearing this band will make enemies drop credits in drop more credit than beer. Um, that's an interesting stat shift, but I'll take it. if we go up here. Oh. I'm gonna go over here and hit that. It'll ease your access. I do appreciate though, like for all the weird puzzles this game has, those are some really impressive stone arts. Things usually appear due to water erosion. There probably used to be a river at this place a long time ago. Yeah, I appreciate for like all the weird platforming puzzles this game has. Like, if you can manage to solve them, then they give you some sort of point of recovery. So you don't have to do the whole thing again, you just go to whatever you've opened up. There we go. 
is a six crystal leaf. Get back up there. Dang. As you, you notice there that uh, something popped up. And that's something that uh, basically caught Leah's ear. There we go. I think we're getting close to the uh, maroon tree now. They got the moves like Jagger and just shimmy up there and give us give us a hand. It's like animals. Animals. Like animals. animals. I'm done. <laughs> I would like to at least get to the maroon tree before stopping. Falling down the hole is definitely not how to get there. I don't think I'm going to get there from here. Pit. 
Have we been over here? Yeah, we have. Definitely have. I think I would get that shot on the first try. I'd like to get that plant there. There we go. I don't think I can make that jump. Also, let's see what this guy has to say. Hi! Oh, hey, you're interested in my job too? She's an explorer. Oh, come on, it's not that big of a deal. I'm part of the ACF's exploration team. Once a year, we're exploring and charting a new, uh, new part of a larger sector. It takes a, as it takes a long time, as we can't just warp ourselves around, but it is pretty fun and exciting. Milky Way Galaxy unlock. That, that's pretty broad. No, that just leads to a dead end. I think this one is going to take some pondering. So unfortunately we're not getting to the tree today, I think. Because we are about out of time. So that is gonna about do it for uh, this week long run stream. I want to thank y'all for watching. Uh, we had uh, Zero and Jewel and uh, Tyrion. Excuse me, Tyrion. Um, Zero, can you let me know if J-Pop is almost done streaming and see if it's worth me rating him? Uh, while you're checking on that, the next scheduled stream is tomorrow at um, 3 p.m. Atlantic Standard Time. It is a co-creator stream, and we are actually going to start working on the um, Archipelago implementation for Meridus. Um, 20 minutes of a run, so we should be good to stream, to, to raid then. Um, the next stream after that is going to be our Sunday Shuffle stream, Sunday Super Shuffle, where I and several other people are going to be playing through said Archipelago Multi-World and uh, having a good time, lots of chaos, lots of fun. And that brings us around the week, around the wheel for our next, uh, code, uh, code creator, our next long run stream where we're going to continue with CrossCode and finally get to that Maroon Tree. Um, sorry, we're stop stopping the um, music here, but I got a tab over here. We're gonna go raid J-Pop, who is currently playing the Seventh Saga Randomizer. Uh, and uh, I'm sure having a nice bit of a struggle there. So uh, with that, I want to thank y'all for watching. 
I'm Coolier if you don't know, and I'll see you guys next time.